You guys, so we're going into our grocery store right now. It is Friday, prime coronavirus time. We live in a small town, a very rural setting, and uh, it's pretty busy here, but I'm gonna take you guys in with me to see like what the tea is and if there's anything available, and I'm taking you in the coronavirus chaos. Use Purell. Thank God they're not out of that yet. Perfect. Usually this is stocked up with carts, but it's all empty. So the goal right now isn't so much, like we're just getting supplies for food, like just canned food. I'm just, we're just worried that the stores are gonna close and we're not gonna have access to anything. So we're gonna get like, pastas and like just easy stuff for storage. I'll just have to go off my diet and just eat a ton of carbs, but. So most of the pastas sold out, so we're gonna take, I guess what we can get here, gluten free. You've got to be kidding me. I don't know what to say. We actually do need paper towels. We clean normally. We don't just buy cleaning products when there is like a mass like virus out there. So we do have cleaning products at the house. It's just it'd be nice to get some backup. I mean this is get this is a little crazy. Guys, all right, so we're getting ready to leave. Everything's pretty much gone. Um, the only thing I found was Lysol. I know, I, we don't. Well, I'm saying, well, what I'm saying is, don't people have like cleaning supplies to begin with? I feel like everyone's buying it just because of the virus. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's a little weird. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Especially this magnitude, you know, it's. It's too much. Yeah. Well, good luck. Stay safe. Oh, thanks. I, <laughs> I actually needed it. I went, I don't... Oh, right. You actually need it. <laughs> you need it. <laughs> right. <laughs> Do the honors, Mark. I can't deal. Okay, so I'm going to the car now. There's a lot of people at the grocery store, and I'm like high key, just weirded out because I have a chronic illness. So. I'm going to the car and we're gonna maybe go somewhere else. I don't know where we're going after this. The only thing I was able to get my hands on was Lysol. So we're at Lowe's now. We really just want our cleaning supplies. I refuse to go in anywhere else, but because this place is like open, we'll go in. So let's hope we can at least get, we have stuff to clean with. It's just, but it's just like having extra in case things close down. Look at all these flowers. I might want to buy a house plant <laughs> now that we're here. Ooh, look at all those umbrellas, girl. <gasps> oh my god, look at all the little sago palms. I'm trying to, I'm still trying to revive our sago palms. Cute succulents. Um, all right, let's find the, let's go to the cleaning supply. these stainless steel wipes actually oh babe look at these for granite and stone is that safe to use yeah 
Okay, all we have is Lysol too. So we're, can we get like something like this for like our bathrooms? Cause I don't have anything like that right now. They're so scandy. Look at that. So. I just wanted to close off this video showing you guys what we got in the mass hysteria last night. It was so creepy just because everyone's just looking around at each other and like eyeing each other up. And then it's like, if one person coughs, it's like, you know what I mean? It's just creepy out there. Um, so I just want to show you what we got. As I said in the video, we do have a lot of our own cleaning supplies just from like having like just buying them normally without this. So that's good. But I did pick us up um, an emergency immune plus. I usually make this like a tea. It comes in these packets, like powdery packets. And I, I put them in like a warm cup. I think you could make them either way you want, but it's 1000 milligrams of vitamin C plus vitamin D and zinc. And I got the citrus flavor. And then of course I got a bottle. Then I got an extra can of Lysol. Now, again, we do have this stuff, but because everything's going so bare and like, I only have like, I'm like almost out of my original Lysol. I was like, I better pick it up now because it was literally the last one in the store. Then we, my husband ran into Dollar General because Lowe's had a lot of stuff, but like even though it looked like a lot of cleaning supplies, the stuff that like people are really interested in, like hand sanitizer, like wipes, cleansing wipes, and Lysols, like that really wasn't there. It looked full, but it really wasn't that full. And then I didn't, they said they sold out of toilet paper. They were like stocked up with toilet paper and that's already all sold out. But when we went to Dollar General, he did, pick up an all-purpose cleanser, a foaming action cleanser. Uh, it's an all-purpose cleaner and you kind of just sprays out more of like a mist. So that's just easier for us to wipe down handles and, you know, just, just keep wiping down counters. And it's, I honestly, I've been using it and it's been so far pretty effective. So you guys don't forget, not only should you be, you know, using Lysol and all of that to kill germs, but also take precaution to like, start amping up your immune systems as much as possible. I think that can definitely help. Also, I do want to look into nasal sprays. Um, I was listening to one of a, a doctor, uh, a podcast from a doctor who specializes in fibromyalgia, uh, chronic fatigue, because of course I have those and I'm a little nervous with them, but she did say to get a nasal spray, an over-the-counter nasal spray, and that way it'll form a barrier inside like your nose from and like the mucus that's inside of you from actually attaching to the virus. That way, if you do breathe in this virus because it is respiratory, you're already going to kind of be coated by that medication so it doesn't affect you. So I thought that was a really good piece of information and could be very helpful. So um, my husband and I are going... Um, to be going over a friend's house later, a very small gathering, but we're all just kind of getting together instead of going out. And I wanna stop and try to make sure to get one of those nasal sprays and that is it. So you guys, I'm just bringing you into the chaos. If you're already in quarantine and just kind of wanna know what the stores look like, uh, that's what's going on. Uh, cleaning supplies so are scarce and it's just so, it's scary in that respect, you know, like, Wow, but just don't forget to take care of your physical self and do as much preventative care as possible. I also have a ton of vitamins. I do eat like vitamin D. That's good for immune system with the vitamin C. And then I'll just do like my magnesium and 
like fish oils and stuff like that. I'm just trying to stock up as much as I possibly can. Of course, I have my Purell hand sanitizer. I haven't seen any hand sanitizers on the shelves at all. Um, and I will, so yeah. All right, guys, stay safe out there. Don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next one.